Hello, I am back at Frankton Primary and we're going to go now and find out more about the character development program that they run here at the school. Hello, and what's your name? Liam. Liam. Now, Liam, can you tell me what virtue is your favourite here at Frankton School? Cooperation. Yeah, and what does cooperation mean? Cooperation means working with others, others, other people and... Um, and can you give me an example of maybe a time at school where you've had to cooperate with someone? Um, working with somebody like Taylor. Yeah. Or, um, Some of your classmates? Yes, or Kelston. And you have to yeah. do maybe a group activity? Yes. Yeah, and that means you have to work together and sometimes that can be hard, can't it? Yes. So what are you doing here today? I am drawing my insect out of my um, Sparks idea book. That looks very good. What kind of insect is that? Um, a stonefly. Oh, cool. I don't think I've ever seen one of those before. They look very freaky. What's your favourite thing about Frankton School, Liam? Um, probably getting to draw and being creative and... Yes. That's awesome fun. I love drawing as well, so I think I would fit in very well here at Frankton Primary. Thanks for talking to us, Liam. Thank you. Welcome to Frankton School, where we open the gates to a wonderful world of virtues. What are your girls' names? Riley. Natasha. Nice to meet you both. Now, can you tell me what your favourite virtue is at Frankton? Peace. Oh. Ah. Pa oh. Patience. Patience. <laughs> I heard you talking about it before. And what does patience mean? Patience means waiting peacefully. Yeah, and so sometimes that can be quite hard. I know I get a little bit impatient sometimes when I have to wait for things. I, when I'm really hungry and I want to eat my dinner, sometimes I'm like, Mum, can you hurry up? I want to eat now. So what's some stuff that you struggle with when you're trying to be patient? Um, I, struggle with, um, I struggle with helping everybody out in my group. Yeah, that can be quite difficult sometimes as well. And what's your favourite thing to do here at Frankton? Play tag with all my friends on the playground. Yeah, and how about you? Well, I mostly like self-discipline. Yes, and what is self-discipline? When you control your hands and feet and keep them to yourself. <laughs> yeah, so it means we're not being annoying to people and we have to control ourselves and be well behaved, which is all very, very good virtues here at Frankton. And can you tell me what your favourite thing about uh, coming to school here is? Mostly learning in class. Oh, well, that's good someone who doesn't like tag, that's very interesting. So can you tell me what you are doing here today? I'm doing some native insects. Cool, so you're getting to look at the pictures and then draw them from the pictures, is that right? Yes. Yeah, and what's your insect called? My one's the bush giant dragonfly. Wow, do you think you'd be pretty scared of that if it came flying at you in the middle of the night? Mm. <laughs> Mr Pye's actually seen one. Really? In real life? And what, what was that like? Did he tell you about it? I don't, can't remember. Yeah, and did it make a really loud noise? I don't know, Goodness, Spy didn't tell us. Now, this classroom's a little bit interesting, isn't it? Because you have a few very young members of your class. So can you tell me what that's all about? It's because my teachers have uh, Mrs Pye's little daughter's Poppy, and she's one, and then there's Bo, and he's actually three. Oh, cute. So they hang out with you in class and do all the same things that you do. Can you tell us a little bit of a funny story about Poppy, something that she's done? She keeps... When I did, when I did a drawing on the whiteboard she, and rubbed it out, she actually copied me. Oh, cute. Babies do like to copy, don't they? So that's a very, very cute thing to see when you're at school especially. So thanks for talking to us girls. It's been great.